Hey guys, it's a Mama Llama. No one is happy 100% of the time. Don't believe anybody who says they are. Happiness is not a destination, it's a journey. You're always gonna have your ups and downs. Perfect example, yesterday morning, everything went wrong. Everything went wrong. And my mindset was just off. And my husband called me out on it. He's like, I don't know what's wrong with you, but you need, you're grumpy. You need to change your attitude. I'm like, first I was like, rude. But then I'm like, he's right. He was right. And I changed it. Well, this morning we had the same problem. My, my, my oldest, he is grumpy. He can't find something he lost. Um, both of us suffer from ADHD and trying to teach him the tricks and tips of ADHD is a little hard sometimes because for me, I need routine. I need things to go put in a certain place. My keys go in the same place every single day. So I never lose my keys. <sighs> trying to teach him to do that is a little difficult. We all have our moments. It's just how we deal with the moment and how we overcome the moment. And some people have a little trouble and need a little help with medication. Others just need some prayers, meditation, going outside. For me, if I'm outside, it really helps. Try some of that mindfulness. Take a moment outside, breathe, take it in. What do you smell? What do you hear? Open your eyes. What do you see? Those techniques involving your senses, thinking about each sense helps calm me down. Um, they do this thing, the, I think, I don't remember what it's called. But it's the calming five where you start with like, I think it's your ears and what do you hear? Name five things you hear, four things you smell, three things you see. Um, two things you taste, like different coming down to just help yourself breathe and focus on the moment and what is exactly in front of you. It helps. It helps you with anxiety. It helps with everything. So we did a lot of that yesterday and I did that a little this morning. If you need to journal, journaling works amazing. If you don't want anybody to read it, tear it up, burn it, do it on your phone, delete. But journaling helps get everything out of your head. I don't think. I just write. I just write. Happiness isn't a, a destination. It's just not. But it is. It is an amazing journey. Because every day you get to make a choice. Every day you get to choose to look at the little things. Like my kitten running in the yard chasing something that makes him happy. Or you can focus on the bad and waller in it. I mean, yesterday, whoo, yesterday morning, I, it wasn't that I was looking for the bad, but I just wasn't laughing and being cheerful like normal. And I needed somebody to pull me out of it. And my husband is perfect for that. Gave me a kiss, told me I was okay, that I was still loved, just like I do with the kids. And sometimes you just need to hear that. I still love you even though you're grumpy kind of cute when you're grumpy and then later he threw a fit and we got to make fun of his fit you learn you do better you know you do better at least you should happiness is not a destination it's a journey enjoy the journey bye y'all signing off